Okay, and this one goes here. And I'm gonna put this one right here and stretch it out. Maybe a staple or two. Ah! Ah! Oh, there we go. An exact replica of the Eiffel Tower in France made entirely out of pool noodles. Wow, Mindy, you're impressive. Mindy, we're here at the mess hall. Oh, wait, I thought we were doing a science experiment. Why aren't we in the cabin of bad ideas? First of all, that's my cabin. But it's full of microscopes and an eyewash station. That you put there. Oh, yeah, I did, didn't I? And second of all, we'll be using things that you can find in a kitchen. Ah, cooking up some science. I love it. So, Mindy, you know how the water in an ocean is different than the water in, like, a freshwater lake? One has a lot of salt in it and the other one doesn't? Exactly. And there's another difference, too. Salt water and fresh water have different levels of buoyancy. Buoyancy, meaning how well something floats in water? Exactly. And to test that, we have two glasses filled most of the way with water, a container of salt, and two raw eggs. It's a... Uh... Wait for it. Eggs experiment. <laughs> First, we want to add a good amount of salt to one of the glasses of water and stir it in. Okay. Now, we have one glass of salt water and one glass of fresh water. Next, let's gently drop an egg into each glass. Okay. And... What did you notice? Huh. Well, the egg in the water is sitting on the bottom of the glass and... Oh my wow, the egg in the salt water is floating, Guy Raz! Yep, adding salt to the water makes it more dense. Meaning there's more molecules in the same amount of space. Makes the egg more buoyant. Meaning it can float more easily. Exactly. I gotta tell you, Guy Raz, these egg puns are terrible. Come on, can't you take a yolk? <sighs> I'm let that one slide. Uh, <laughs> Well, that's all for today, campers. But before we go, here's a quick refresher on today's saltwater egg experiment. Take two glasses and fill them up with about three quarters of the way with water. Then stir a generous amount of salt into one of the glasses. Gently add two raw eggs to the glasses and watch the egg in the salt water float. Oh, and grown-ups, you can go to tinkercast.com slash camp to find printable step-by-step -step directions to conduct your very own saltwater egg experiment at home. And don't forget to take a photo or a video. Grown-ups, you can upload pictures and videos to us at tinkercast.com slash share. We also want you to tell us about what you have loved about Camp Wee Wow so far or share your favorite way to play with or in water. Do you swim in it? Have any other water games that you play with friends? Like to fish? Tell us. Just call us at 1-888-7-WOW-WOW to let us know. We might even share your call around the campfire this Friday. Until then, who wows? We wow! wow.